गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू ऑनलाइन केमिस्ट्री क्लासेस वी आर ऑन चैप्टर टू एलिमेंट्स एंड कंपाउंड्स टॉपिक फॉर टुडे इज प्रैक्टिसिंग सिंबल्स एंड केमिकल फॉर्मूला सो लेट इज बिगिन सिंबल्स ऑफ एलिमेंट्स क्वेश्चन नंबर वन राइट द सिंबल्स ऑफ द फॉलोइंग एलिमेंट्स फर्स्ट बेरीलियम लेड आर्गन क्रिप्टन गोल्ड एल्यूमिनियम बिस्मिथ सिल्वर सिलीकॉन जर्मीनियम सो दिस इज द क्वेश्चन वी यू हैव टू राइट द सिम्बल ऑफ द फॉलोइंग एलिमेंट्स फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई वॉन्ट टू टेल यू दैट यू नीड टू लर्न एज मैनी सिम्बल्स दैट यू कैन from the periodic table which i have already given in the lesson in the first lesson of the same chapter i have given you so you have to learn as many symbols as you can from the periodic table with the name of the element so the first element over here is beryllium the symbol for beryllium is be lead symbol is pb argon symbol is ar krypton symbol is kr gold symbol is au aluminum symbol is al bismuth symbol is bi silver symbol is ag silicon symbol is si germanium symbol is ge so these are some of the common elements which i have given over here but you need to learn as many as you can question number 2 write the names of the following elements now the symbols are given now you have to write the names of the symbols o is oxygen c is carbon cu copper fe iron h hydrogen s sulfur एच ई हीम एंड नाइट्रोजन सो द क्वेश्चन इन एग्जाम कैन कम इन बोथ द वेज इधर द नेम ऑफ द एलिमेंट्स विल बी गिवेन यू हैव टू राइट द सिम्बल और इधर द सिम्बल विल बी गिवेन एंड यू हैव टू राइट द नेम्स सो दीज आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ क्वेश्चन वी हैव डिस्कस्ड क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री वॉट डज टू एच टू ओ रिप्रेजेंट ना ओवर हियर देर इज अ कंपाउंड given now you have to write all about what is this molecular formula representing here answer 2 h2o represents the following the name of the compound what will this formula represent name of the compound name of the compound is water number of molecules is 2 how can we say that because in front of h2o how many numbers are written Two. So number of molecules of water over here are two. Constituent elements are again two, which is which are H and O, hydrogen and oxygen. Number of atom of hydrogen subscript is two, so atomicity of hydrogen over here will be two. Number of atom of oxygen subscript nothing means it is one. so all these things are represented by the given chemical formula question number 4 write the formula of compound in the following cases now you have to write the formula number 1 a molecule of calcium oxide consists of one atom of calcium and one atom of oxygen how will you write a molecule a molecule means one molecule of calcium oxide calcium over here there will be two elements calcium and oxygen calcium uh, symbol is ca oxygen symbol is o so the formula will become ca o as you can see in answer for one ca o how ca o calcium one molecule of calcium ca and one molecule of oxygen o so the molecular formula becomes ca o question number 2 the two molecules of zinc sulfide 
consists of one atom of zinc and one atom of sulfur over here two molecules of zinc sulfide so the answer will be 2 why 2 this two number is representing number of molecule two molecule of zinc sulfide 2 zn s zn is zinc one atom of zinc and one atom of sulfur that is represented by s third three molecules of iron chloride consist of one atom of iron and two atom of chlorine over here how many molecules are asked three so what will be the first number over here three three molecules of iron chloride in that how many atom of iron one atom so fe and how many atom of chlorine cl two atoms so cl two the formula become three fe cl two so this is another form of question which can come in the exam you have to write the chemical formula now let us come on the keywords that we have discussed in this second chapter elements a substance made up of identical atoms compounds a substance made up of two or more elements chemically combined in a fixed proportion molecule of elements contains atom of same elements molecule of compound contains atom of different elements symbol shorthand notation of writing names of elements so that is all for today's class thank you students the chapter is completed do revise the previous topic and clear your doubts if any have a good day.